Number 17, Cherry Blossoms. All right, we are going to be working with cut time today. First, we're not gonna play it in cut time. Then we're gonna learn what the piece is and then we'll do it in cut time. All right, so this piece is, is a Japanese folk song that uh, is pretty um, common. You should know it. Um, I know it so well because of the game Punch Out. Um, Piss and Honda would come out and, and this is the song that would, that would come out with it so um so this is more of an a minor kind of scale so we're we have the key of c major we have no sharps and flats but we're starting on a and we're ending on e so we're not really resolving to to anything um that would be related to c i mean the e is related to c but anyway um it's more of an a minor so we have the low two on the d the a and the e string so it's going to sound a little bit um, wonky at first. So we have a one, two, da, one, two, da, one, two, three, four, one, two, and da, one, two, three, four, one, two, and da, one, two, three, four, one, two, and da, and, and, and so it plays that three times in a row, and then it goes back to that main theme. At the end, we have a one and two, da. And we're gonna cut everything in half in just a minute. I just want you to get these fingers down nicely. Um, when we go from the E to that C back to the E, I'm leaving that first finger down. So looking at the last measure of our first line, E, C, E, F, E. at the first measure of that second line, I'm leaving my first finger down. E, E, C, B, E, C, E, F, E, E, C, B, E. I'm not lifting that first finger off at all of my D string. So take your time to really program that in. Do it with just uh, plucking and then do it with your bow afterwards so that you can make sure that it's comfortable. All right, don't forget your low twos. Not on the G string though. So you might have to write something, use your ear. Um, let's go for it. One, two, ready, go. <laughs> Um, at that last measure, we're doing a B, A, F, B. I'm using my first finger as a reference point. B, A, F, E. I use that first finger. Use your reference points. They're there to help you. You've trained that first finger so much. Use it. All right. So uh, now let's dive into the cut time. So we've been using that C. That C just means common time. Common time is 4-4. Four, four. And now we add a line through it. It looks like a sense sign and and so it's just cut time we're cutting everything in half so what is half of a quarter note is an eighth note what is half of a half note a quarter note so now we're counting this one and two one and two one and two and one and a two so we have those new kind of like 16th notes in there so um check out how to do 16th notes we have one and a two and a and when they're broken up like this is one and a two and a one and so we'll go over that with more eighth notes uh more 16th notes in the future and i'm sure i have other videos on it so this is lento, nice and slow. And I really like to use my subdivisions for it so because this is almost agonizing. Two, one, two. So subdivide. One and two and one, two, one and two. One and two and one and a two and so let's do this from the beginning with that um let's count the first line and um 
Let's just count through it real quick. All ready and go and one and two, one and two, one and two and one and a two, one and two and one and a two, one and two and one and a two. One and two and one and a two. One and two, one and two, one and two, one e and two. All right, let's give it a go. Count with it as many times as you need to. Loop it. Ready and go and. <laughs> of different reasons. Um, first of all, so that we can um, make things faster uh, and have just normal writing easier to read and just say one and a two and a da 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 and so that it doesn't seem as, as daunting, um, but also so that we can have the accents on different points. And so what's the difference between four, four and two, four? It's where you have your, um, your accent. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. If we don't want that, we want two, four. One, two, one, two, one, two, which sounds completely different from one, two, three, one, two, three. So I was I was confused if I had four, four, and two, four, two, two for quite some time until I really felt the difference. So feel that difference of one and two, one and two, strong and weak and strong and weak strong and weak strong so so really really connect with those beats so that you can um get the feel of the music good luck